Uh, hey everyone, so this is the editorial for problem A. Uh, this problem actually took place yesterday, so I was just up solving it. So, this is the problem div 2A. I think this is also in div 3, not in div 1, of course, but yeah. So, the question is you are given a string s of length n and you are given some integers k. You need to check if it's possible to remove exactly k characters so that the remaining characters form a palindrome. So, I hope you all know what a palindrome is. Like, that's the basic thing that's the only basic thing you need for this and you are given two integers n and k general constraints 1 e 5 so uh, this is a simple problem uh, now the thing with palindrome is like it's a very simple thing uh, for example let's just make a map like how the characters are actually so suppose you have a which occurred actually a total of four times and there was B which uh, which was in the string for a total of six times so this is just the map so I if you rearrange this A and B uh, you can easily form a palindrome because both of them are occurring even number of times now suppose if I put a C over here uh, and that occurs three times so still it is possible because there can be only at most one character which has actually an odd occurrence so in this case that is C and you can actually put C in between so in the end it would be something like A, B, B, uh, B, 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 C would be in between because it is the only one with the odd occurrence then again repeat the same pattern B, B, B and A. So this would be your palindrome. Uh, now so that was the basic fundamental you need to know that uh, at most one character can only have an odd occurrence now once you know that the problem becomes very simple for example in the given string you uh, create a map of character like you create a frequency map and you store it in s in this form only like a occurred four times b occurred six times and c occurred three times now if i say there is no odd occurrence now if there is no odd occurrence no matter whatever k i give you you will always be able to form a palindrome and why that is because uh, suppose if k is a even number so you can always remove uh, 2 from b 2 from 4 and it will still remain a palindrome like you're not actually uh, getting the fundamentals wrong like you're not actually breaking that constraint that at most one number should be odd and the other should be even you, if so let's just say till now we don't have any uh, character with odd occurrence and k is anything even or odd so what you would do is suppose if k is even you can remove 2 from here 2 from here then again 2 from here 2 from here it would not break your constraint uh, because all the occurrences are even at, and it would remain even if you keep on removing 2 2 from each one of them and k is even so eventually k would be 0 and you would still have a palindrome but what if k is odd so so let's just say we have k as 3 k as uh, 3 so this is still not an issue because you can remove 2 2 and as soon as because k is odd eventually k would become 1 because you're only removing 2 2 from each character and when k is 1 just select any character and make that character as odd just remove a single occurrence this would again not break your constraint because in the end you selected a single character and you changed it from even occurrence to odd occurrence and still your uh, remaining characters will be able to form a palindrome now this was the case when all of these are even or odd now what if you have a single character uh, yeah what if you have a single character that is of uh, odd occurrence now again let's consider you have k as even when k is even again you have no issue you can remove 2 2 from the even ones and you can also remove 2 from the odd ones because even minus odd would again will keep you in odd only so that's not an issue but uh, yeah mm. now what if k is odd uh, if k is odd you can remove 2 2 from the even ones and from the odd ones also and in the end again you would have 1 when you have a single k left you can just select the one which is odd because you cannot make an even one as odd because then you would have two uh, uh, characters with odd occurrence and that is not allowed so when you have a single k left you can just select the character which has odd occurrence and you can change its odd occurrence to an even occurrence so when so I, so in the end all the characters ha uh, have an even occurrence and that is uh, the cur uh, that is the required constraint for uh, the characters to be able to form a palindrome now the so you just saw no matter what the case is you can form a palindrome except one case which is when c is 3 and there is one more character 
which is uh, let's just say this is also 5 now no matter what case so let's just say case 7 when case 7 these characters right now cannot form a palindrome so you have to waste some amount of k so that you can fix this and how do you fix this like how do you like how will you fix this what you will do is you will use some k and change so let's just say there is one more over here uh, I have E with an occurrence of 7 so there are total of three characters which have odd occurrence and that is not allowed so you will have to change any two of them to even so anyways your k would reduce by 2 and as soon as your k reduces by 2 that means again it becomes a problem of so where will you use your k you will make this 4 uh, you will make this 6 and k now became 5 then again it reduced to the same problem like which is your k is 5 you have one with odd occurrence all the rest of them are even again you will apply that same logic so the only thing that only issue that you can get where you will have to print no is are you able to convert the extra odd ones to even ones and that is only the no case now if you look at the code yeah so you made a map uh, of character frequency you i don't know why i counted even i had some other logic before but you counted the number of characters which are even and odd and you simply have to check can you convert the extra odd occurrence characters to even ones if you can't do that your k is not able to satisfy that constraint you will have to print a no otherwise it's a simple yes so yeah like it's a simple problem that was it for like you just have to check if you're able because that is not allowed you cannot make a palindrome when you have more than one odd occurrence characters so that's it for problem a div 2